Hello, thank you so much for joining me for another day. Do give a shout out to all the frontline workers. They have made a lot of sacrifice and they continue to make sacrifice. Some even sacrifice uh, from meeting with their family, uh, saying goodbye to the young ones so that they stay in the hotel and they can continue to serve. Do pray for them, do encourage them. Today we're going to look at the scripture from the Gospel of Luke, chapter 9, verse 10 to 17. Very familiar passage about Jesus fed the 5,000. What really stood out to me is when Jesus said to the disciples, you are going to feed them. Even the disciples said to Jesus, it's getting late, send the crowd away so that they can find something to eat, they can find a place to stay. And Jesus said, you are going to feed them. Have we really considered, have we really thought about this? How much Jesus does with what we consider so little. How much Jesus does with what we consider so little. In the other gospel, it talks about that the five loaves and the two fish came from this young boy with young age. That's all he had. He offered it to the disciples. Sometimes we think that, no, it doesn't really make a difference. I just have so little. Or it doesn't really make a difference. I can't really do much. I can't really go there. I can't really visit. I can't really, there's so much. I can, I can, I can. When in our eyes, what we consider so little, imagine how much Jesus does with that. You know, we know how the story goes. Jesus said to the disciples, ask them to all sit down. They don't have to come crowded, whatever, sit down. You guys are going to feed them. Wow, what an amazing story. And remember what Jesus does. It's like the communion. He took it. He blessed it. He gave thanks. He broke it. And he gave it to them. That's our lives. When we consider so little in our lives, if we allow Jesus to take it, and if we allow him to break us, well, first he bless us, he give thanks, and then he broke us for the others. And he gave it to them. Now he said to his disciples, you are going to do this. You're going to give that to them. You're going to hand that out. That's our lives. That's our lives. Ask ourselves, where is our devotion? Where is our devotion lies? Is it lies to ourselves? Or does it lie to Jesus? Jesus, we are devoted to you. Even we consider so little, which a lot of us, it's more than five loaves and two fish. But how much Jesus does with that. And then he's asking us to feed the people. He's asking you and I to feed the people. What a privilege. What an honor. I wanted to leave that with you today. Thank you so much for joining me. Let me pray. Do you have any father? We give thanks for today. We give thanks for the frontline workers. Lord, we ask that you to protect them, to bless them. We ask the Lord you to protect their family and bless their family. Be with them. Be with us, Lord. Help us to give what we have, what we even consider so little, in your hands when you take them, when you bless it, give thanks, and when you broke it, you give it to others. You give it to us, you give it to others. Lord, it will multiply. Those people will be able to be full, 12 basket full, more than abundance. Lord, we have this abundance life in you. Thank you, Jesus, for your love. In your name we pray. Amen. Have a wonderful day.